I really enjoy being at ESO because of the diversity of people and activities that I do here. ESO is a place where astronomers and engineers shape and design the future of our field. The doors open to me by ESO. I think there's so many that I'm not even aware of all of them yet. Each year, several outstanding early career scientists have the opportunity to further develop their independent research programs at the European Southern Observatory. Fellowships are available both at ESO's headquarters in Garching near Munich, Germany, and at ESO's Astronomy Center in Santiago, Chile. ESO headquarters is situated in one of the most active research centers in Europe, boasting one of the highest concentrations of astronomers in the world. High caliber scientists instrument experts and other professionals within easy reach provide fellows with valuable opportunities for starting collaborations and learning new skills. These programs helped me in my career um, as it brought me together with people that are very relevant for my field and essentially um, allowed me to start new research programs. Being at ESO has helped my career because one of the opportunities that you get at ESO is exposure to experts in both the science as well as the technical side of things. The Garshing Fellowship program is quite unique uh, in many ways, but mostly because of the environment we have here. With the talented people, hundreds of people, astronomers, one of the biggest campus in Europe and in the world, and the very, very strong support that we're bringing to these fellows for the three years they spend here. So the research set here is quite rich. It goes from comets, exoplanets, to star formation regions, protoplanetary disks, galaxies, cosmology, high redshift objects. It really covers the whole set of topics that we have in astronomy. So if you're passionate about astronomy, come to ESO. It will definitely change your life. The ESO Fellowship has been a fantastic opportunity for my career. It's the first time where I'm truly independent in my research. I'm taking control of what I'm doing on a daily basis. I enjoy most about my fellowship that I can work in an extremely diverse and international environment. And through my ESO duties, I have access to instrumentation and to gaining a deep insight about the instruments and facilities. So what I really like at ESO is the possibility to be independent and at the same time to collaborate with people with different expertise and also the um, possibility to really see the full uh, scientific process from the initial idea and how proposals are selected through the possibility to go to the telescope and see how the sky is observed until the final publication. In addition to developing their independent research programs, ESO fellows in Germany are expected to engage in so-called functional work for the organization for up to 25% of their time. Although initially perceived as a burden, the functional duties for specific ESO projects prove to be enjoyable and fulfilling and have a very positive influence on fellows' careers. So the functional work that the, uh, the fellows are conducting here is a unique opportunity for them to connect to these projects and to learn new skills. Uh, these will be super important when they go on with their career. My main part in this functional duty was looking at new algorithms. As a functional work here, I'm uh, going to Paranal three times a year to observe. That's a great experience uh, to understand how a telescope is uh, working and uh, how observations are carried out. During the fellowship, apart from research, I work in the user support department, so I help the users to develop their observing programs. I'm working with the new Supernova Center, which is a visitor center and outreach center that ESO are developing, opening in 2018. I'm very passionate about outreach. In addition to the fellowships at ESO's headquarters, ESO offers a similar program in Chile. The unique aspect of the fellowship in Chile is the opportunity to work so closely with instrumentation and, and state-of-the-art telescopes. Being closer to the instruments, you learn how you can take the most of it. We are looking for people who are passionate about observatories. You work for 50% of your time for three years 
And then you have a fourth year that you don't have in Garshin, totally free of duties. We can plan the duty work in a synergetic way to actually benefit the science development of the fellow. I love the combination of functional duties at the telescope and being able to concentrate on my science here. The functional part of the work, it's, it can be tough, but it's incredibly, incredibly rewarding and incredibly enjoyable. The people here are really collaborative. I think that the teamwork is a must for Paranao specifically. Usually you get some collaborations or can discuss science in an informal way. So this environment is very good for, for science. We have a small community of fellows are working together and spend time together. We exchange information on science and then we had a great time together. That's the part I enjoy the most. Regardless of which program they chose, be it in Chile or Germany, the ESO fellows are fully supported to conduct frontline research. At the same time, working at ESO equips them with essential practical skills for later in their careers. I've learned how to multitask, I've learned how to prioritise, I've learned a lot about instruments that maybe I wouldn't have used in my own science beforehand, which now I'm thinking about. And, of course, both Germany and Chile offer great opportunities to have fun outside of work. For me, one of the great things about working here in Garking is my ability to cycle everywhere. In my spare time, I really, really enjoy travelling. South America is incredibly accessible from Santiago, so I've had the opportunity to travel around South America as well. If you would like to become our next ESO Fellow and fast-track your career, apply to our Chile or German programmes and take into account the advice from our current or past Fellows. ESO is a place for curious people, so if you're curious, just come here and explore all the possibilities that there are. Come to ESO and ask questions. I think I got the most out of ESO by just knocking on doors and speaking to all of the people. Come and visit learn about what we do and do great science because that's the most important thing here.